Dear students, in this topic, we shall discuss the cardiac output and stroke volume. Cardiac output is the quantity of blood pumped into the aorta each minute by the heart. The average cardiac output for resting adult human is about 5 liters per minute. Dear students, the cardiac output is uh, affected by and varies widely with many factors including the basic level of body metabolism, the physical activity of the body, size of the body, age and gender. ये तमाम फैक्टर्स जो हैं कार्डियक आउटपुट को अफेक्ट करते हैं। ये स्टूडेंट्स, इन कंपैरिजन टू कार्डियक आउटपुट जो के पूरे एक मिनट की क्वांटिटी है, उसके मुकाबले में स्ट्रोक वॉल्यूम जो है, दिस इज द वॉल्यूम ऑफ ब्लड व्हिच इज इजेक्टेड फ्रॉम द हार्ट बाय ईच बीट ऑफ द हार्ट। इट इज the difference between volume of the ventricle just before contraction, jise ke end diastolic volume kehte hain, and the volume of the ventricle at the end of a contraction, jise ke end systolic volume kehte hain. In dono ko, jab minus kiya jaye, to jo nitija nikalta hai, that is called stroke volume. Dear students, the stroke volume is determined by dividing cardiac output by heart rate. Mathematically, when we calculate it, we calculate the heart rate by the heart rate. Changes in the output of the heart rate are determined by the changes in the stroke volume result from changes in the end-diastolic or end-systolic volume. In may say, if volume change, ho, to as a result, stroke volume change. Ho jata hai. The end diastolic volume depends on four parameters. Number one, venous filling pressure. Number two, pressure generated during atrial contraction. Number three, distensibility, yani expansion of the ventricular wall. And number four, the time available for filling the ventricle. The end systolic volume depends on two parameters. Number one, the pressures generated during ventricular systole and the pressure in the outflow chambers or channels. Outflow channels, kon kon se hai? that is, aortic and pulmonary arteries.